For the third time, Eastern Kentucky has won the 2023 Kentucky State Fair Pride of the County's Best Exhibit Award. The booth showcased tourist attractions, festivals, and recreational activities throughout the region. We are proud to represent the Kentucky State, State Fair uh, booth. Uh, the Eastern Kentucky region is a partnership between um, multiple counties. So we had Pikeville Pike County Tourism, Letcher County, Floyd County, Paintsville Tourism, Boyd County Tourism, um, Carter County and Montgomery County, Mount Sterling. So it's a really, it's a unique collaborative effort that we all get to go down and represent Eastern Kentucky as a whole at the State Fair. And uh, what an honor it was this year because we were chosen to be uh, the best exhibitor booth for the Pride of the County section. So Kentucky Farm Bureau uh, chose our booth this year as the first place winner. Did you hear about the wireless plan with no credit check? No contracts, but tons of great features. It's Forward Pay with Appalachian Wireless. Deals start as low as $19.99 per month for unlimited talk and text and no long-term commitment. Use your own device or ask about deals on the latest and greatest devices. Some as much as $250 off. Forward Pay on the region's best network. Because we are you. We are Appalachian Wireless. The AppalachianWireless.com for terms and conditions. The booth also showcased local musicians, artists, woodworkers, and held craft demonstrations. Eastern Kentucky being represented at the State Fair is very important to our local economies. It allows us to showcase what each of our communities have and then also to invite folks to travel to our part of the state. Um, lots of times we are overlooked, but when you are there and you win and you're the best in show at the Pride of the Counties. And, you know, we can spend the, the entire 10 day process talking to folks about our region of Kentucky really opens their eyes to see what we have to offer. And really when we have those people there like quilters and woodworkers and jewelry makers and painters, and then our musical artists, it's really, they're baffled with how much talent that we have in our region. And it's a big draw for people. Reporting for Mountaintop News. I'm Brianna Robinson.